Okay, so nice. I'm going to make you the host so you can share your screen. All right. And have you do you have your back office link ready? Because I don't want to be doing going back and forth. Do you know yeah, what I'm is your back office? I'm logged in already. Okay, great. So for for those of us who um don't know what our back office is please um it's office two dot economy dot io i'm going to type it on the on the chat so you can just search that on your chrome while i make nice the host so you can share the screen his screen nice your host now so share your screen please i'm typing back office access for everyone so just copy and paste it so nice to share your screen. I I see my screen now. Yeah, your host, you can share your screen. Yeah. I'm in the I'm in the office. Your your back office, great. Okay, so um yeah, thank you. So guys, once you log um get onto this platform. Your back office is the one of the first thing you need to get to because it has your ECA. So for those of us in Konokopia, we've separated the links so to make things easier. But once you come on here, you click on go to home. And then you come down to Forex. So now because you are new in this space, the first thing you want to do is your learning. You have zero knowledge about what you're about to embark on. And even if you are not new to Forex, learning and unlearning certain things doesn't hurt anybody. It actually expands your horizon of knowledge. So you want to go to your ECA. So please come down to your ECA. So it brings you straight here and then you log in. So guys, you want to be repeating what we're doing with here. So you, you already know how this works. So the same thing you're seeing, just log on to your platform as well, and then just repeat what we're doing. So, yeah. Guys, so once you log in, you want to click on ECA English. So come and click choose ECA English. Okay, great. Now you all, all the short videos, if you scroll through all these short videos, please go back, see English, thank you. Just stay there. So all these short videos are basic foundational videos that you need to know about what you're about to embark on. Because the more you learn, the more you earn. And for some of us that are new in this space, this is like your go-to, this is your friend, just make it easy your friend and you pack money basically. So um, that's the first thing you want to do when you come on board here. So yeah, you want to make sure that you have, you watch your ECA videos. It doesn't take so much time because the videos are short, three minutes, four minutes, five minutes. Like, and you take notes, not take notes. Some people don't watch live film. That's not how to learn. Get your daughter. Like as you're watching, you're taking note of stuffs because I, I, I always expect that after ECA, she asks me questions. That's what I always expect. Because I'm like, if you don't ask me questions, I will ask you. So I always expect that you watch your ECA with the intent of learning. You don't know what you like film. So basically, that's what your ECA does. It teaches you. And then that's the first step that you do once you get started here. So um, thank you. Um, you can go back to your home now. Back. Yeah, to back your... to home. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Great. So once you're done with your ECA, mm -hmm, the next step is your Telegram details. I see that you've already done your Telegram. Um, user ID. <clears throat> so guys, for those of us that have not done ours, can you just hold on, please? 
So for for those of us that have not done theirs, mm -hmm. your Telegram details has steps to follow to get it. Now, please scroll up a little. Yeah, scroll up a little. Yeah, thank you. So your Telegram details has the steps to get your user ID. Once you get started on here, each person has a customized ID. You understand? Um, His ID is different from mine. Yours is different from every single person's own. So that's why it's very important that you get your Telegram ID. So it has on here steps to follow. So it says steps to get your user ID in Telegram. You go to Telegram. So please, let's go to Telegram because for some persons who don't know how this works. So you go to Telegram. Yeah. So um, let's so it says search for user info, but so um, go back. Go back to your back office. No, go back to your back office. Remember, some persons don't know how this works. So step two says, step one, right, says go to Telegram and search for user info bots. So you're not just going to Telegram aimlessly. You're going to search for user info bots. So let's go to Telegram and search for user info bots. This is it. Guys, I hope we're following. Yes, please, let's click on it. Guys, I hope we're following. So now, once you come on board here, all you need to do is just click the start button. You understand? He has already gotten his ID. That's why it's like he has everything popped up. So for those of you who you know you've not done this step, just watch after your ECA, this is what you do. So you click, no, there's no need. This start was a. Automatic. So, thank you. You click start. Yes. You click start yes, like, and. It will still pop up. Yeah. Mm hmm So please go back to your Telegram. So you can see it has his ID. For those of us who are following these steps carefully, if you do the same thing, you will see your own personalized ID. All you're doing is copying it. So you just click on it, highlight it, copy it, and then go to paste it on your Telegram. So let's go, go on there. Yes, so you paste it here and then you click save. You want to save it. So you click save. Once it you click the save, there's a cloud bar up that loads. So click save, click save. So you see that stuff come up. Just know that it's saved automatically. So then that's what um you do to get your Telegram ID. So now we're going to go join all Telegram groups because these are channels by which you can access the tools and the products that you paid for. So we're going to click on Forex and then you choose Manara. So um, we're going to scroll down Remember, we're trying to join all Telegram groups. So you click on this highlighted words that says Telegram link. So you click on it. I have joined the groups so that- I I'm seeing it. Part. I'm seeing that I have done everything. <laughs> <laughs> please, can we use someone that has not done this thing, please? That's, that's even the first step. The first step look for someone that has not done any of these things please please, please. Never do, um, all right all right
I've not done it, please. I just I just entered the group. I just I was I'm busy. Sure. I'm sure. Screen, please. Nice, make me host back so someone else can share their screen. Okay. This was the name King B. If you know you started today and you don't have any of the Telegram groups, please indicate so we can guide you on how to join it. Please, I'm, I'm new here. I'm new here, please. I'm just joining now. Please indicate using the chat. Like you okay, so um let me know your name because some of you don't save your name on Zoom. What's what's your name? So I can make you the host and then you can share your screen. Ebuka. Okay, I'm going to make you the host now so you can share your screen. Okay. All right. How do I share my screen, please? Okay, so um just tap once you tap on your screen, you see the icons below, and you see an icon saying share with an arrow up. So you click on it and then choose screen and then start broadcast. Okay, great. So, okay, um, great. so um, just go to your back office, just go to your back office. I'll log in, right? Yes. My... Just follow my instructions. Yes. Go to your back office. Please drag. Just this follow my instructions. Go to your back office. Please, Please drag, drag this um, icon but, out. Queen, what's the problem? Icon Ebuka. out. Queen, what's the problem? Ebuka. Yeah, I can but, hear you. Do you have two devices on? Because we are. Do you have two devices on? Because we are. No, no, no. Just phone. <sighs> There's something wrong. There's something wrong. There's something wrong. There's something wrong. Please stop. It means someone has uh, turned on their Please stop. Mugen. Someone has uh, turned on their mugen. No. Where should I go to now? Please. I just joined, so I I'm I'm like confused. Please, can you? Hello. Hello, yeah, I Hi, can hear cook. you. Okay, cool. Whenever you share, share again. Let me know echoing. Because once you started sharing, you started echoing. Share again, let's see. Like, where should I go to face on my... Just click on share. The same share you, you, you clicked on. Yeah. I'm there. Okay. Hello. Oh. Hello. Yeah, I can hear you. Hello. Yeah, I'm just um if I'm uh echoing. Yeah, I'm just um if I'm uh echoing. Stop screen, please. Let someone else share. I'm yeah. Stop. If you want to share, just please. Drop let someone else share. Yeah. Just drop me in the chat box. Let me uh so just no, you don't even need to drop me in the chat, just click share. Anybody can actually click share. I've made everybody to be able to share. So the first person to click share should share. As long as you've not joined the groups, okay. You've not set up your demo account, your MT4 account, you've not set up your Manara. Please go ahead and share. Click on share. Okay. The first person to click on it will be the one to share. Tap the middle of your screen and look for share under. Once you click share, just click share screen. Okay, Galaxy X10 is sharing now. All right, great, great, great. Oh, uh, Coach Blossom, please go ahead.
like I've I've done my I've done my registration and everything just to how to set up my Manara. That Hi, Ilkar. So, um, please go to your back office. I hear you. Yeah, I can hear you. Please go to your back office. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes, we can. Um, click on your okay. home button. Go back. Let's click on my what? Did you follow through the training? Because I want to start from the beginning. That's why. Did you follow through and then? Yes, yes, yes. I did. Yes, yeah, so while with you, please, why is your browser not loading? Okay. What am I doing? <clears throat> okay, so we'll just start off from where we left off. I saw that you had successfully gotten your telegram details. Okay, so yes. um click on Forex. Manara. Please click on Manara. Hello, Ibuka, can you hear me? Someone with a better network should share their screen because we're not supposed to stay long on the call and so just basics who has a better screen and hasn't done any of this you know you you've not done any of this you've not joined any telegram group you've not done set up your manara you can um request to share your screen so christian have you joined any group if you have not joined any group, you can share a screen. So go to your back office. So go to your back office. Drag the icon out. Drag the icon out. Is the echo we were avoiding? Is That's the echo we were avoiding? That's why we had to like to tell you to. We stop had sharing. to like to tell you to stop sharing. Outside of Christian, who else hasn't done this? So we can use that to guide everyone. Guys, this cause is for you. It's not for me. So you all should be that like volunteer. Word. I'm just going to guide you on what to do, and then you do it. Boy, Buka, your network is glitchy. We need something more stable, so everyone can learn from it. Remember, you're not the only one on the call, so everyone can learn from it. Stable network. If you know you have a stable network and then you haven't done any of this stuff, please can you volunteer to share your screen? We're 30 on the call. 
and nobody is saying that um they are willing to share their screen so they can learn So who is Zoom user? Zoom user, I don't have a name. So Zoom user, share your screen. You spent 30 minutes going back and forth. Thank you. Zoom user, do you have a name? You can omit all and then. I think it's Ma Ma Michael, Michael Cardinal that is showing. Michael Cardinal, that's what's showing. Okay, so um, just log in and then click on your Manara. Your home button, Forex, Manara. Okay, scroll down. <laughs> Click on the Telegram link. Just once. Great, your joint. You can see it. We can't see it because that's the security. Um, what's it called? security measure so that's why we can't see it but you've successfully joined you can um go back to your back office and um let's continue with other links you can see it right you can see the link that you joined yes so come as um no go back to your telegram michael go to your telegram What are you seeing? What's the title of the link that you're seeing? Hello. Yeah, okay. Well, where can I go on the title now? Because I'm in I mean I'm in I'm in a telegram. Yes, I'm no, I know you're on the Telegram link. What's the title of the Telegram link you're seeing? Because you have so many groups. So we need to okay. search and pin the group that you, you just joined. Yeah, it's Manara. Manara Trade Association. Great. Yeah. So go back to your Telegram. Okay, fine. Yeah, there it is. Guys, for those of you who have um too many groups on your telegram when you join the telegram group, go and search out the groups so search manara manara um trade ideas and session pin it pin this group yeah I have so go it. back go back great go back to your back office let's go and join other groups yeah i'm here yeah so forex and manara Yes. So go to the next stone, Forex and Manara. Okay, fine. There. Yeah. So scroll down. Join the Telegram link as well. Click on the Telegram link. Okay. It says Forex and Manara training. Okay. So go and pin that group as well. Okay, fine. Okay. Um, let me just unpin these others. 
Yeah, I've pinned it. Okay, so go back. Go back to your back office. Here? Yeah. Um, Click on your menu line. Your menu box, the white menu box. Yeah, here. Yes, so come down to Eminus. Eminus? Mm hmm Okay. So, um, join the Telegram link. Great. You can go and pin as well. Yeah. So go back to your back office. Choose Arabic. Arabic. There. Click the Telegram link. Same process. Go on um, pin. I hope everyone is following. <laughs> okay, so I have reached the limits of uh, my pins. So um, you your your you have you have at least five um yeah so on pin whatever you need to on pin yeah but I I can remember them okay so go back to your back office okay Spanish also no you're not Spanish click not on your Spanish. home button okay so um. I'm going to be showing you how to set up your Manara. So click on Manara. On Manara. Yes. I'm here. Yes. So for this, I'm going to be um calling Coach Dami to um she's the one she's doing the call with me. So okay. Coach Dami, are you on here? Coach Dami. Okay, let's just continue. Okay, so click on your. Hello? Dami, you can unmute yourself. I, I'm not stopping you from unmuting. Galaxy. Um. Okay, so um, you have to unmute her. Michael. Yeah. Mm, okay, that's fine. Okay. I'm in Zoom. Where should I go? Okay, good evening. Hi, good evening. Good evening, good evening everyone. Can you hear me? Can yeah. everyone hear me, please? Yeah, please. All right. My name is Dami Lola. I'm an influencer. I'm 500. <laughs> I'm an investor of 500 of this academy. So I'm so happy to meet everyone on the call. You guys are welcome to the academy. So basically, after um, joining the Telegram links and setting up your back office, so we are going to set up Manara now. So um, I'm going to be using Michael's Manara. Yeah. Can everybody hear me clearly? Please, if you can hear me loud and clear, please drop um, a one in the chat box, please. All right, guys, thank you very much. So let's get right into it. We are not wasting time because time is far spent. So um, let's go straight to Access Manara now. So guys, this setting we're about to do, this setting we're about to do is the recommended settings you are meant to use for your Manara. So do not subtract and do not add anything. I hope you guys understand. So uh, Michael, you can access Manara now. Let's set your Manara up. Okay. okay. So click on that three lines up. 
Yeah. Go to monitor. Click on monitor. Click on um security. This Monara has not been set up yet, right? Yes. Okay. So here yeah, you can see different currency pairs here. So um we stick with the major. Hold on, scroll, scroll back down. So um this minor and exotic currency pay, you have to you, you're going to have to um remove the currency pairs we do not trade. Like this odd HKD, you have to remove them. So we stick basically to the currency pair we trade every day, like the forex currency pairs. We are not trading any weird currency pairs. So the odd HKD, odd SGD, card HKD, please just um, remove those ones. Can you hear me, Mr. Michael? Yeah, I can hear you. Uh, it's yeah. about my on, phone. It has on jumped. That, oh, sorry. On that, the yeah. minor and exotic. Yeah. Yeah. Just hold on, hold on. Don't. Mm -hmm. Now remove odd HKD. Okay, I'm trying, but uh, it seems like uh, it's not working. Yeah, it's not working as of now. But we are clear that we have we have heard you that uh, I, I, we should stick to the major ones. Yeah, under this minor also we trade some currency pairs on that minor, but just that yeah. all these uh, weird ones you have to remove them from your settings. Okay. Yeah. So scroll up, please. I don't know if everybody understands what I just said now. Stick yeah. to the forex currency pair. Do not trade any weird currency pairs. Okay. Scroll up. Scroll. Scroll up. Let's see. Go down. Okay. Scroll up. Scroll up. Scroll. Scroll. So you have to remove yeah. all these ones. You can. We don't trade that. Is that we, everything? Uh, the the miners. We trade part of the minors, not everything. These weird ones, odd yeah. HKD, odd SGD, card yeah. SGD, you have to remove those ones. We do not trade that. Okay, fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that everything? Uh, yeah, I don't know what's happening Scroll with off, my... Sure. But... Hey, hey, now, hold on, hold on. Yeah, hold on. You have to calm down so I'll be able to see your screen very well. Just okay, scroll bye. up a little. Scroll up a little. Mm -hmm. So all these ones, you have to remove them. Okay, fine. You're going to remove everything, yeah. So scroll up, scroll up. Okay, guys, I hope you are, you are, your website is uh, it's removing, but mine it has a stick, so... Yeah, it has... Uh, you don't have to... Remove. You don't have to put it off. If you put it off, that means you're not you're not going to be getting signals for all this currency pay. I only said the ones that are weird, like or we we trade or CHF or JPY. We, we trade CHF JPY. You just have to remove the ones that we do not trade. Okay, fine. Um sorry, Coach Dami, he can turn it off and then select the pairs he wants. It will still okay, work. Okay, 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 that's fine. I hope you guys understand that. You can turn it off and select the pairs you want. Please scroll back That's up. That's for want... him because his his stuff is. I don't know what's happening. Okay. Uh, I I I get you guys. I get her. Is that uh, it means that uh, when you want to trade some of the, these places, then uh, you can turn them on. Since my phone here, uh, I think I don't know what's happening with it, but it's jamming. So hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Scroll up a little. Yeah. Scroll up. Now you have to turn off bonds. Hey, is it your um, screen that is operating itself like that? Yeah, I think so. Wow. Because. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Okay. It's crazy. I, I'm, I'm, I'm using a low version of, uh, of uh, Android. So that's why maybe it's doing this. Can we use somebody else's Manara? I want everybody to get this part though. This, this part is very necessary. 
ton of bonds. Your screen is not even coming down at all. Is there somebody else's Manara we can use? You know you are new, you have not set up. Let's just use your Manara and set up, please. Yeah, I guess someone can share. Oh yeah, Ebuka. I hope your network is okay. Please. We've taken too much time. Yeah, so I can leave? Yeah, yeah, you can. Please, Ebuka, if your network is okay, share your Manara. Ebuka, are you there? Hi, Jesus Christ. Hi, Jesus Christ. You people are not giving energy. You people are not giving energy. Please, who is that to meet yourself? Please, who is that to meet yourself? I can hear myself. I can hear myself. Um, I think you need to um, allow him. I think you need to allow him on mute. Coach Blossom. Coach Blossom. Can you guys hear me now? Yeah, we can hear you, please. Yeah, we share can hear you, screen. please. Share your screen. Why am I hearing myself? Why am I hearing myself? What else? Is this your Manara? Is this your Manara? Yeah, this is my Manara. Okay. So, okay. Go to is this, okay, go. Is this okay? Okay. No. Please, why am I hearing myself? I don't understand. Bro. Where should I go to? Go to monitor. I said other. Once you access Monara, go on the monitor. Dami, sorry. Um, Galaxy S10, please share your screen if your network is stable. The, the the thing why we can't use yours Ibuka, is it's echoing and it's a recorded training it means that other people who could not attend this will watch that so imagine if they cannot clearly get what we did here because it was echoing okay the echoing is from his part okay ah good Network. I don't know strength in this name. Um, we are meant to spend just an hour on this call, and we this is almost an hour, and we are not we've not gotten anywhere already. Hello, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Okay. This Galaxy S ten. Yes. All right, please access Monara now. Let's get right into it. Okay. Yeah, please scroll up. Top right. Yeah, no, like, this is down now. Yeah, I'm coming down. I'll be up, I don't know. Yeah, just like I said before, the major, these are the major currency pay that we treat, the major ones, then under minor and exotic. I think <coughs> it's turn it off. Turn minor and exotic off. It's not okay. Okay, I'll turn yeah, it turn off. It off. Then after turning it off, you pick the ones with you are going to trade. 
we trade odd chf or jpy click on it click on it. yeah what jpy um chf jpy still on that same euro hot click on that scroll up um gpp card hold on gpp card gpp cad gpp nzd nzd chf come down NZD JPY. Scroll up. Scroll up. Now, let's move to the second line. No, no, still on that minor. The second line. Let's check. Let's check. Hold on. Hey, Euro NZD. Hold on, no, Mr. Man. Okay. Let's just, let's just go and start from up. Scroll up. Scroll up. Uh -huh. Now, what ends it? Yeah, scroll. Scroll. Euro card. Euro card. E U R C A D. Scroll up. Euro ends it. E U R ends it. E U R N E U R N Z D. Okay. Yeah, GPP hot. <clears throat> GPP AUD. Scroll up. Uh -huh. and the uh, NZD card. NZD card. Card, card, yeah. Scroll up again. Scroll up. Scroll up. Yeah, that's that's basically all. So this ones that you picked. Are the ones you get signals from. The reason we are selecting is because we don't we don't want to we don't want to make your malaria messy. Imagine getting a, a lot from all these currency pairs, you'll be confused. So put off your bond. We don't trade bond. Scroll up. We don't trade indices also. So put it off. As a beginner, though, once you um, begin to study and if you would like to take any of this currency pair, you can do that. But as a beginner, we don't trade these things. Just scroll up. We don't trade commodity also. Then metal. Under metal, the only thing we trade under metal is gold. So switch off metal and just select gold. Switch off metal and select XAUUSD. XAU USD. Don't, don't. Yeah, now scroll. scroll. It's, it's, it's That's really everything, strange. right? Okay. Yeah, now, yeah. Just leave this part. So we are basically done with this. Just click on security. Mm -hmm. Can you scroll down? Now click on settings. Now, guys, pay attention to this. Everything we are doing on this person's manara, please duplicate. Just like I said, these are the recommended settings. You don't want to um the same thing we are doing here. Make sure this is what you are going to be setting up on your manara. So just to get the right setup. So for your pattern status, click on incomplete. Now for the time frames, we recommend from the 30 minutes to the higher time frames. Stick to the higher time frames. So um remove M5, M15. Remove M5. Remove um weekly and monthly. We are not a long time trader. So guys, stick to these time frames here. Yeah. M30, H1, H4, and daily. So these um these time frames they have the most accurate setup. Then under asset class, remove commodity bond and indices. Bond. So forex and metal is what we are trading. Is that everything under here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Okay. No, no. Patterns. Okay. Now, uh -huh. for your pattern, guys, this one is <clears throat> pay attention. The only two recommended pattern is the bat and butterfly pattern. Everything else, please remove it. Bat and butterfly. Yeah. Stick to bat and butterfly alone, guys. Is that all under here? No. Pattern type. Uh -huh. Bullish. But pattern type bullish, bearish. Remove or no. So we only want to be getting signals for the bullish market and bearish markets, the buying market and the selling market, basically. So let's link here. So now once you are done, once you are done setting up your monitor, you have to save your settings. So now click on view defaults. Now type your under hard new view. Type your type whatever you want to name your uh, Leonard signal, Leonard multi-millionaire signal, whatever. Now click on that plus sign in front. So you have saved your settings like this. So sometimes when you come back to Manara. And you see that your setting is not looking like what you set up. Just come to this view, this view default, and just click on that that thing that you saved. It will save. It will automatically um adjust the settings. I don't know if you understand. Yeah, once yeah, you understand, set up, understand. yeah. Once you set up your monitor, make sure you save. Make sure you save your settings. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now yeah. click on. Let's go to notification. We just worked on monitor. Now click on that three, that three line. Oh, let's go. Yeah, let's go. To, you are lost. Hey, find yourself. Who? Oh. And you didn't see anything since. Who me? No, I saw somebody said he's lost. Okay. Why don't you understand? Please, let's get back right into it. <clears throat> hey, Buka. You said you are lost, you're not saying anything. Please let's go to your notification. On that manner. Go to notification. Click on settings. We are, we are, we are, we are. Remove the time frame. The pattern setup is incomplete. This is on that notification, right? Ah. What's going on now? Coach Bluesom, I think um the guy is trying to unmute himself or something. Please ask your question on the chat. The way the guide with the incomplete just did, ask your question so she knows what to do. Like the guy sharing his screen, I think he's trying to unmute himself. Okay, great. Let's continue. We are, um, you know what to do here now. Yeah. 
guys, I'm saying it again. Please stick to these settings. Okay. Stick to the settings. Is that all? Oh yeah, let's leave here. Scroll up. Uh -huh. That's it. Scroll up. Just click on settings to leave this place. So now, guys, um, we have watch list here. You can add the um any other currency pair you want to be getting signals from, like me. Under my watch list, I added Malara Trades cryptocurrency also for people interested in cryptocurrency. So you can add it here on your watch list. You can, if you're interested, you can add BTC USDT, Ethereum USDT, XAU USD. You can add currency pairs to that watch list so you get the signals on that notification. Watch list. You can add. The currency pair you want to be seen, you can add them here. Yeah. If you're interested in cryptocurrency, you can add BTC USDT. You can add Ethereum USDT. Manara treats that also. Do you guys understand or do I need to repeat anything? Please, if you don't understand, put it in the chat box. Please show us how to add Ma. Oh, yeah. What if, what? Go ahead, you're typing something. Time frame. No. No. The reason we are sticking to higher time frame is because the pattern, the um, strategy Manara uses to scan the market, which is the harmonic patterns, it works best with higher time frames. It works best with higher time frames. That's why we don't use the lower time frames. That's why. Ah, you do not understand how to set up the signal. We are, we are, don't you understand? Okay, please let's go back to the monitor. Guys, we have less than 10 minutes on this call. Let's be fast. Um, Galaxy S10, ABS20, please. Let's go back to monitor. If a monitor. Click on settings. Oh, security. Let's start from security. So on that monitor, you click on security. Once you click on security, you see the major currency pay. Don't touch it. We trade um the major currency pair. Then you come under minor and exotic. They are so like, as you can see, you can't be trading all these currency pairs. So we have the selected ones that we trade for Forex. So that's why you need to turn off your minor and exotic and pick, pick the ones, the Forex currency pair that we trade. So that was what he did here. Don't worry, you, you have access to this record so you can watch it again. To understand, it's not everybody that will understand immediately, but that's why the session is recorded. You can just go back to it and you understand everything. Just do it the way it is done here. The same currency pair you picked here, make sure you are picking the same thing. Follow the exact step, it is step by step. You will see everything in, in the recorded session. Just take your time. Yeah, uh -huh. you can take a screenshot too. And take a screenshot then don't forget to save your settings once you are done picking your currency pair setting up save your settings on that monitor make sure you sit save your settings it's very important so that whenever you come back to manara and you see that your settings your manara is not looking set up maybe you have seen different currency pair that you did not pick just come back on that monitor and click on your saved settings you don't have to screen record it. This session is recorded. You will have access to it once we are done. You don't have to screen record anything.
Guys, do you understand? Please let's let's um, move forward. You guys will have access to this um, recorded session, so you just duplicate, just copy, copy and paste, copy and paste. People used to copy in exam or now. It's basically the same thing you are doing here. You just copy and paste it. Watch it and follow the steps with your own manner. Coach Dami, he didn't do the alerts from Telegram directly to from his manner what? Telegram. What? He didn't do his alerts. Okay, okay. He has not he has not set up that um manner FX. He has set up notification, but he needs to click the telegram into alerts. You okay, okay, okay. Oh yeah, um what's his name? Michael. Michael. Oh, Leonard. Leonard, sorry. 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 Go back. Okay, sorry, Coach Blossom. Are you saying we should go back to that Telegram stuff and connect like the alerts? That's user bots info ID. Is that what you're saying? Coach Blossom. After successfully doing his Manara setup, he's supposed to go to notification and click on the Telegram icon. Okay. On that notification? Yes. Oh, he yeah, has done his Telegram. setup for notification, right? Click on. Okay. Somebody was saying we should show how to add this thing to watch list, Abby. Yes. Uh -huh. Well, yeah, click on your watch list. Now, on that symbol, and type, type BTC USDT. BTC USDT. Binance, yeah. Click on it. So that's a, that has been added to your watch list. So you start getting signals for that. You can add Ethereum. BMB, Kineco, any, any, I had them here. You'll be seeing the signals for it. So now let's click on this telegram, this telegram icon that is showing down here. Let's click on it. Telegram. <clears throat> Start. So here you are. This is the Manara FX bot. So if you don't have time to be checking your back office, like you don't want to be logging in, you don't want to go back to your back office and go and be logging, logging in. Manara will send you signals from here. Also, you can get access to Manara signals from your Telegram also. I think after you click on start, it's meant to bring. It's meant to bring an um, information or something. A lot. Type a lot. How do you add other pairs on your watch list? You simply just did that a few minutes ago. Oh. 
Oh, if you just came in late, wait for the recorded session, you see it. What's the email that you registered with now? The bot is communicating with you. It's English, it's English language. What is your email? Now go back to Manara. Let's go back to Manara itself in back office. Now click on that three um, lines. Click on account. Yeah. So this is your token here, authenticated token. Copy. Yeah, let's go and paste. Now you have subscribed to notification. So you start getting notification from, you start getting notification. I think it takes about 20 to 30 minutes before you start getting notification. So everything that is coming from your back office, once it is ready, you come, the Manara will send it to your Telegram also. So all the trace from your notification, you get it here. So you can decide to pin this, this Telegram link, this group, you can pin it also. If you don't want to be stressing yourself and be going back to the back office, you can pick your trades from Manara here also. So for the people that came late, please just watch the recorded session and just follow the steps, it's easy. I think that's all. Okay, thank you so much, Coach Dami. So guys, now I'll be showing you how to um take a trade. But first, we need to open your demo account. So um, please um go to your MetaTrader four or five. Good morning. You already have a demo. Okay, I need someone that does not have a demo so I can show them how to. Oh my password. If you don't have a MT4 demo already, please feel free to share your screen. Okay, Emperor, you can share your screen. If you don't have a demo, you can share your screen. To share your screen, tap on your screen. You see the icons below that says share. Click on share and Screen start broadcast, great. Okay, so please go to your MetaTrader 405. Well, you already have your, come to your settings. You already have a real account. Why did you share your screen? If you're a newbie, please, I would like to show you how to start taking demo trades. You just learned how to do your Manara setup. And now it's, the next thing is how to take those trade ideas Manara is going to be sending you. So if you don't have a demo account, you can't take those trades she'll be sending you. Where would you take them, I mean? So please stop sharing so someone else can share. If you're a newbie and you don't have a demo account, you've not opened the demo account yet, please you can share your screen so I can guide you on how to.
Okay, so I'm going to take it that everyone has a demo account already. So thank you guys for the call tonight. The recording will be out shortly and shortly okay. and okay. Oh. Okay. So so you have a demo already. You have a demo already. Mary, if you don't have a demo, um, Mary, if you don't have a demo, you can share um, a screen. I want somebody that you can share a screen. I want somebody that is showing invalid account. Okay, go back to your showing invalid account. account. Okay, go back to your metatrader phone. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. Go back. So guys, well, once you down, yeah, so guys, you well, once your, you down, yeah, you download your five. You come to settings. You come to settings, and for Android users, and it's for a, Android slightly users, is a um, slightly different. Um, click on new account. Um, click on new account. Open a demo account. Open a demo account. Meta codes demo. Meta codes demo. Mm -hmm. Scroll down. Mm -hmm. Scroll down. So register. So register. Guys, are you seeing what he's doing? Put your email. Guys, are you seeing what he's doing? Put your email. Okay, click um done. Okay, click um done. Scroll to the next. Scroll to the next. Done. Click done. No, thank you. Guys, is that easy? So Basically, you just open the demo for yourself. Click done. No, thank you. Guys, is that easy? So, basically, you just open the demo for yourself. Yeah. Um, Blossom, why are you, what are you, um, echoing? Yeah. Um, it's Blossom, why are you, what are you, um, echoing? It's from him. This is Mebuka. Why did you allow him share again now? This is Mebuka. Why did you allow him share again now? Because it was open for everyone to share. Nobody did. He did. You know this call is recorded so that you don't confuse people. Do you understand? You, that, that's the reason why, you know, we just want you to go straight. You don't want, you know, things like this on the recorded call. So it, 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 does this mean that it's only a book card that does not have MT4, right? Does this mean it's only a book card that does not know how to do copy and paste? Like, this is a newbie's launch call. If you're a newbie, you don't have MT4, drop it in the chat box. Just drop me in the chat box. So, Kristen, I'm going to unmute you. Kristen, go ahead and share your screen. Go ahead and share your screen. Just tap the middle. Look at the icons. You see mute, start video, participant chats, reaction, share. Click on share, then click on screen. Then go ahead and share your screen. Kristen is there. Mary is there. So, please, either Kristen or Mary, click on the share button and share your screen, please. The first person to do that gets gets it. It's very important you share your screen because we are using you to do the, you know, do the class. You will get it better. Kristen and Mary, are you there? 
if nobody's sharing their screen, we can just close this call and call it a day. Let everybody go and sleep. Since everybody knows what's, what's, well, you know, they already know how to use MT4, right? The remaining 20 people on this call are De Fela, Bode, Comfy, Emmanuel, Emperor. You all know how to do it. Like, if you're all good to go, then let's just close the call. Everybody, you know, we do, you don't need a call. You don't need a class. Because this is a new beginner's call. We have 20 people on the call and nobody is willing to, to Mary and Christian. Infinix, share your screen. You have an empty for demo. That's fine. Emmanuel, share your screen. Emmanuel King, share your screen. Mary, you can still share your screen and download it. It doesn't take time. But Emmanuel, since you have empty, uh, empty for share your screen. Have a demo. Share your screen. Whoever has a demo, share your screen. I already thought to, you know, open a demo account. We already have that on file. So someone should share. Okay, we already have someone sharing. We have Galaxy S10 sharing. Fantastic. So let's teach how to copy and paste from the Signal group and copy and paste from Manara. Let's go ahead, please, Coach Blossom. Let me make you host. So please go to your empty four. So you already have a demo. Well, oh, this is this is MT5. I thought you say you have MT4. Can you go to MT4? Is MT4 we're using for this class, please? Mary, have you downloaded your MT4? Okay, good. Very fast. Thank you. Okay, great. So let's go to your settings. No, hold on, go back. So for Android users, it's slightly different. Once you come to your codes, please go to your codes. Click on your menu line. Click on your menu line, on the three menu lines upwards. You see um, manage accounts. So you click on manage account. You already have a demo. Okay, so click on um the plus. Okay. Great. So click on your menu line. Open a demo account. Get started. Open a demo. Click on open a demo account. So search search for who goes way. Who goes way? H U G O H U G O S H U G O S. Yeah, that's it. 
just click on that. So put in your name. Can you see on personal information, your name? It says minimum six characters. Can you put in your name? So Leonard is seven. They said minimum six. Did you see what he wrote before you started writing your full name? Okay, that's that's good. Um, so create account. Leonard, what's the problem? Create account. done click on done that's how that's how you create your demo guys i hope we did the same search broker and everything so for iphone users it might be slightly different you just add new instead of manage accounts it's you see add new So now we're going to be going to the Telegram groups to take trade ideas and then I'll be showing you how to copy and paste. So please go to your Telegram groups. Yes, that is okay. If you have something higher on your demo, you can even go higher. But well, one five is okay. One ratio five hundred. Leonard, can you hear me? Please go to your Telegram groups. And why are we on Play Store? Who else doesn't know how to copy and paste? Please. You don't know how to copy and paste. Please share a screen. You don't know how to take trades from Manara. You don't know how to copy and paste trade. If you see a trade idea now, you don't know what to do. Please share your screen so I can show you what to do and everyone, everyone else can learn from that. Okay, Imano, please share your screen. Okay, so please go to your manner on Telegram. iPhone users is the same thing. Copy and paste is the same thing. Have you done your man? Uh, have you done if you've opened your demo on MetaTrader four, just like I showed you on here? It's very easy for iPhone users. It's you will see add new when you click on add new. You search for the broker who goes way. H U G O S W A Y who goes way. Click on it. You see the demo. You click on that. Put in your details just the same way you saw. Create your demo account. Once you've done that, we're coming on our Telegram to take trade ideas. So what we're moving doing right now is showing you how to take trade ideas when you see them. So please go to your Manara FX. Your Manara FX bot, Imano. Please pin it. Go back. Pin it. This pin cuts across everybody because some of us, our Telegram can just look like very wonderful. So go and pin every single thing. You're not the one sharing. So who's sharing? Nice girls. Go and pin your your um go and pin pin all your groups. 
Oops. Okay, so just learn, follow what I'm doing here and then learn. So come and click on your Manara FX bot. Great. You see that a trade idea has already dropped. As you did your notification this evening, a trade idea has dropped. So um, tap on this idea, tap on the picture. Zoom in so you can see the entry and positions. I, I don't see the candle. They gave us numbers. We want to see the numbers they gave us. That's what we're going to go and copy and paste. Great. Thank you. So, guys, anytime you get trade ideas from your Manara, you want to take note of your entry. The first thing you want to take note of is your entry. Now, if you um zoom out a little, I want to see the right top below. Now, um, each trade idea you get, will, they will tell you what you're doing. Now, bearish, look at below, look at the writing below. It says Euro JPY, 30 minutes bearish, but completed. And then it gives you your entry. Now, so bearish means sell. Anywhere you see bearish, you know that you want to sell. So you're going to see ideas that will say bullish. Bullish means buy. I'm going to type it on the chat. So bullish buy bullish buy bearish sell so when you see um things like this you already know that okay i'm going to my meta trader for to sell so you zoom in on the um trade idea they gave to you so now look at it closely guys who can tell us our entry it says 157.77 a candle is blocking it because market is already there so guys any trade idea you get straight to your telegram like this it's at market execution we're going to do it so you see what i'm talking about so if you look at the writings below it already gave us the entry it says 157.779 so hello. hello coach blossom yes coach have you told them how to set up their manner yeah they've done that all right thank you so we're going to go and take this trade idea on your meta trader for now you want to take note of your entry remember i said guys the entry it will be written to you down below and you also see it on all these pictures look at your target one it has the digit you can even zoom clearer if you're not even seeing it well to so make sure that oh you know what you're seeing right to so know what you're seeing so it gave us the entry 157.83 right so let's go to our meta trader four we know that bearish means sell. And they've told us, okay, it's Euro JPY. We're going to sell on the currency Euro JPY. So we'll go to our Meta Trader 4, right? Come to your quotes. You now go and search for Euro JPY. Oh, where is Euro JPY? Mm, I'm not seeing Euro JPY. Uh, you will now come to this plus sign. So anytime you don't see a pair on here, you come to this plus sign and you search Euro JPY. So E U R J P Y. So it pops up. You click on the plus sign to add that. Go back. Click on the plus sign to add the pairs. You click once you search out the pair, you click on the plus sign. So you see that the pair comes on here. So you click on it. Euro J P Y. Guys, remember we're going to sell. Bearish means sell. So you click on trade. Right. So it's instant execution for iPhone users. You will see it as market execution. Okay. So the first thing, another thing you want to take note of is your lot size. Now, because we always trade one to 3% of our account size, which is your risk management. So for now it's a demo. So 0 0.05, it's actually okay. But sometimes you can also ask your coach, oh, okay. What um account site I want to fund with two hundred dollar account? I want to fund with hundred dollars. So you know that you're going to re reduce your lot size to. If yours is not coming up, it means that you already have it. So scroll through your quotes carefully. 
and then look for it. So um, 0 0.05 is okay, guys. So let's, if it's not a demo, your ideal lot, there is no specific ideal lot size per se. This is because everybody's trading account size is not the same. I can have a $500 account size. You can have a $100 account size. Me and your lot size cannot be the same because what you'll be able to be, 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 be willing to risk is not what I'll be willing to risk. Do you understand? For you that is using $100 now, you can, you'll be trading your risk percentage is 0 0.01 to 0 0.03. Or zero point zero four. I would on my um five hundred dollar account. I can use zero point one zero. That's zero point ten, because my account I have more equity than you. I have more money in my account than you, so I can actually increase my lot size. Your lot size affects the results of your trade, and why we always advise people to um follow your risk management is because. You see someone with the hundred dollars, and then he's trading with the lot size. Yes, ma. You can also show them how to use my FX calculator for to to you know to calculate their lot size. All right, ma'am. Okay, so guys, um, because it's market execution. Let's did um, it means the market is already at the entry. So remember they, they give us our entry at 157 point something, right? So go go, let's go and cross check it again. Look at it 157.833883 basically, and we are what selling bearish, right? So go to your meta trader for. Wait, remove, remove that first. One fifty seven point eighty three, right? We're selling, right? You want to sell high? This is not already drop, but so just click sell because that instant execution. Just click sell. Can you click sell, Leonard? Or oh, who's who's sharing screen now? Thank you. So click on click on. Click on the um what you just did. Click on the trade, slide it to the right. You see modify. So click on modify. Come and put your stop loss from your telegram and your take profit. So go back. Look at your stop loss. So one five seven point nine two. So go and put it in. So your take profit. Take target one, one five seven point six four four. One five seven point sixty four. So click modify. After the decimal, you just want to focus on the next two digits basically. So guys. I've modif we've, um, we've modified this trade idea Manara just gave us while we're on this call. And so, as you can see, the trade is already in profit. How to know when your trade is in profit is that it is blue and then it's reading, right? It's moving, it's moving. Because some people ask you, oh, how do I know when my trade is in profit? How to know if when your trade is in profit, it's, it goes blue. And then it's reading. When your trade is in loss, you see it is red and it's minus. You understand? This blue goes red and it goes on minus. You see minus in front of it. That's when you know that your trade is in loss. And then so you just wait for it to go into profit before you close it. So how to modify? You just, once you've taken your trade, you just drag 
drag it. So let's drag it again so you can show those people who don't know how to modify. So Leona, let's drag it to the side again. Drag it to the left. Exactly. So you click the modify pencil. This works for iPhone users as well. Ah, sorry, I don't know. All you guys will not put your name. So I should, I'm supposed to be calling you Galaxy S10. So this is it. Once you drag to the left, you see some icons below. And then put in your parameters, your stop loss, your take profit, and you click the modify button. So go back. Go back. Go back. Drag. Let me um, let everyone know what the icons stand for. Drag. First icon is, I think that's to close your trade. So click on it. This is how to close your trade. For so people say, oh, I don't know how to close my trade. I'm seeing it's a profit, but I don't know how to. This is how to close your trade. You drag the first icon there, drag it again. The first one, you click on it. The first one that shows like this, when you're ticking something good, you click on it, you see close with profit. Yeah, so that's it. And then when you click on it, it will close the trade. But we're not closing the trade. Oh, did that? Oh, yeah, I got to place it again. Oh, got to place the trade because oh, we're not done and you went to close the trade. Do it, do it again. This time, I'm not going to tell you what to do. Do it. Everyone's on the call. Tell us what you're doing. Where are you going to go? It's it's on your telegram. What go to your telegram? You're taking ideas from your telegram. Your entry, you're taking out of your entry and your um what you're going to uh, your entry for to do. It's very important to know that you're going there to sell. So bearish means sell, bullish means buy. So take note of your entry 157.8 of um that's fine you can watch the video and then do it anybody that did just set up will get signals you don't have a problem about not getting um your signal once you do your setup and then you click the notification to alert you will get signals that's not a challenge i have a question so put in your stop loss Your trade is your money is not gone until you close the trade. Do you understand? Once if your trade is a loss, right? Until it hits your stop loss, the trade is not completely the mo your money is not um gone. It's, it's a running trade. Do you understand? It's not it's like your money is not gone or consumed. Do you understand? Like you were asking. So, for example, now it's in loss. This is when your trade is, is running in loss. You understand? It's not like gone. The money is not gone. It's just running in loss. But once you close the trade, yeah, once you use your hand to end the trade, the money is gone in loss. Yeah, once you do it to end it in loss, the money is gone. Or once it hits your stop loss, you saw that we did take profit and stop loss. Once it hits your stop loss and close on its own, once the trade closes, in loss, any how you do it, either you close it in loss or it closes itself by hitting your stop loss. Once it closes in loss, then the money is gone. Not all of your money, just the amount that you're seeing that is in loss, not your whole equity. That's why we always tell you to trade with your um risk percentage, follow the risk percentage for your funding capital. If you have a small account, Follow the risk percentage for your small account. So um let's go and download FX calculator so I can show you all how to um know what lot size to use. So open your FX calculator. For those of you who have not downloaded your FX calculator, 
go to your app store or play store type fx calculator you see it, this logo download it download is very effective and beneficial to your trading journey so now once you get here you open it guys i hope i see what i'm doing you click composition please you can mute if you want to talk where you are there's no problem you can make use of the chat to communicate so um you click composition size mm -hmm. so um the account currency click on the drop down arrow now we're trading euro jpy so oh your account currency usd Just, just type USD. So um financial instrument, click on it. That's your currency pair, Euro JPY. Type it. E U R J P Y. Um, it pops up, click on it. Then your account size now. So like we'll, we'll do from the smallest one. I know everybody's capacity is not the same. Basically, let me just use a, a, a um, $100 or $200 account. Let's use, do, do $200 account size to um do this. So I'm just showing you all, for example, whichever account size is yours, if you're on the 500, if you're on the 100, you are going to put your account site on here. So, for example, let's say $200. Let's say that's my account. My funding capital I'm using to trade is $200, for example. So, um, scroll up. So, um, click on um, amount, these three menu lines. So we want to click percentage because remember I told us we trade one to three percent of our account per trade. So now let me let's put one. Because we remember how to change this to percentage. You click on this menu line and choose percentage. So on your stop loss in peeps, right? We I don't like there's a video on how to calculate pips, but like let me just show you the easier way. Click on this um three dotted lines as well. So let's put um stop loss in price. Click on price. So go and put your entry price. The manara gave us on your telegram. An entry price of one fifty seven point so put your stop loss guys. I hope we are seeing this. Okay, so let's scroll down. It already calculates everything for us so scroll guys why this thing is so easy is because it already calculates all your risk for you and tells you what to do so while risking two dollars right the lot size we're using is what scroll it says standard lots mini lot and micro lots so lot size we're using is what 0 0.03 look at it your standard loss it says 0 0.03 so you know, I I I said for a smaller lot account size, you can use like your lot size will reduce. For his demo now here on his demo, he has over a uh, hundred dollars. But if you know you're not going to, you're going to fund with like two hundred dollars or or thereabout or low lower. It's nice to all also practice with the lot size that you're going to fund your account with. It helps put things in perspective of okay, I can make so 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 amount daily when I found, you know, that kind of thing. And then you can now start um, 
re- learning to do that while you're practicing on your demo. So it's told us our standard lot size for our two hundred dollar account. To on this Euro JPY trade, we're going to um take the trade with zero point zero three. So guys, let's go and take the um this thing. This is how to calculate your loss size. I'm showing you guys because someone asked me, oh, what loss size can we use and all of those. So with your FX calculator, it's so easy to just know what loss size to use and then how much you'll be risking on a particular trade. So in, guys, if this, this trade goes in loss now, um, for example, you'll just be losing $2. You understand? So with this, I already know that, okay, I'm only going to lose two dollars if this trading goes in loss, but if it goes in profits, I get to um get more money. So that's just basically why it's very good. You get to have um more funds. So it says zero point two thirty in pips value. I think you will get to know more as you learn on the go. But basically, this is how you can calculate your lot size and then know what to trade with so go back go back i hope we now know how to get our lot size the person that asked me then steven okay all right so go back to the trade yep yeah so um Basically, this is how you take a trade, basically. And once you see your trades in profits, just click on this place. So let's go. Mm -hmm. The first one, the first one is what you're clicking, right? So we don't close trading loss, you understand? So once you see in profit, you just click, drag your, um, drag it, click on the first icon and then click close just the same way he did the first time when he was in profit so go back um yeah go to your telegram mm -hmm. so yeah this is how you can take trades for manara so go back Mm, let's see our Eminus and others. So, guys, for um Eminus, yeah, go back, go back to your Meta Trader. Ah. Multiple trade taking at once is the same thing. Like now, this one, we, we, we use TP1. If he wants to take this trade and put TP2, he will just click on click on your plus sign and take the trade again, sell again, modify your parameters. Do you understand? Modify. Put in your parameters, then put take profit two do the same thing again you see people do it like five times all, all of those things but if you have the account size for that then you can do that because once you open a lot your lot size for example 0 0.03 on a particular trade and you open 0 0.03 five times you're not trading with 0 0.03 anymore times 0 0.3 times five that's what you're trading with that lot size is what you're trading with so Basically, you want to trade with what you're willing to lose. Do you understand? You're not over leveraging and over risky. Over leveraging is what makes people cry and when they lose in the forest market. Like, oh, mm -mm. we're here to make money. We're not here to. There'll be losses, but your wins should be more than your losses. That's why we always say trade with what you're willing to lose. Like, follow your risk management. You can take multiple entries. For example, if I know that my highest loss size is 0 0.05, mm, and then I want to take three entries or four entries at once, mm, what I'll do is I'll divide that my 0 0.05 to five places. If I divide 0 0.05 to 
in five places. That's 0 0.01 on each trade. So I'll go and change my lot size. Go to your lot size. Go back. You've already taken this trade idea. You can put in your parameters later. You already know how to do that. Go, go to your plus sign. That's just like we want to take the trade again. So I know that 0 0.05 is my highest, right? So and I want to take more than one entry because you get more than one trade idea. You say because you have one trade idea, you will not um take another trade idea. No. You definitely. So that's why you want to break down your lot size. If I know that 0 0.05 is my highest lot size I'm supposed to trade with following my risk management and I want to be able to take three trades or four trades, I should be able to reduce my lot size to 0 0.01, 0 0.02, 0 0.03. Do you understand? If I'm doing 0 0.03, I know that I can only take one or two more trades with 0 0.01 or in two places, or 0 0.02 in one places. So that's how it works. Please, is MT4 better than MT5 white trading? They are the same thing, right? Why MT5 works more is for Android users, because sometimes um, for Android users, their take profit and stop loss is not detailed. The user interface is different. Understand, but if you're an iPhone user, basically they are the same thing, they function the same way. You get so that's it. Which one is A minus or Manora GC again? Okay, so go to your telegram. Let me explain this thing to you. You have Manara FX, but that's this Manara FX now. Mm, this is from your Manara setup so that you don't want to be logging in all the time to your back office and say, and opening asset, go access Manara now to take trades because you're not going to be have all that time or um, always, right? So that's why you get the notification state straight to your Telegram because you can be anywhere with your phone. You understand? Maybe just sitting with your friend or even taking a meal or a walk. The notification pops in. Do you understand? Oh, there's a trade idea. It just pops in. You click on, you zoom in the picture and then you go and take your trade idea. You get? So that's why you get the notification straight to your phone. Instead of going to your monitor where you have your monitor and those pairs, no, you get the notification straight to your phone. Right? And so your Eminus Arabic, Eminus Arabic is what you also paid for. You do not just pay for Manara. If you go through your back office, you see under Forex, you have Manara. You have your ECA, which is your learning. That's the first thing you do on here. You also have Eminus. So Eminus Arabic, they also drop the trade ideas. Why do we not trade short time? Because we want to give you quality trades. If you, over time, when you're more experienced, this setup are best for beginners. Do you understand? I personally, no, I'm not a baby in this space. So definitely, if you look at my setup, I can't even use my setup to teach you because I have some things there that you guys don't even have on it because I've, I've this setup is best and has the most quality traits for you guys. There are some risks that I can take. You can't trick, take it. You don't have mind to take it because you're still new and you're learning some things. There are certain things I know and you don't know yet. Do you understand? I can scalp on a trade and leave immediately. you still be looking at the trade and wondering, oh, should I close it? Should I leave it? What do I do? Do you understand? So to call to all those trades, we just gave a preferential setup for beginners and intermediate traders that works best for them so your emnus arabic is also where you go to, to take trade ideas please click it open so everyone can see click on your emnus arabic oh she spent so much time hello who's here click on it click on it so you can open How do you join the group chat? It's a, it's on your Telegram. Go to your login, log into your back office. Once you click on Forex, you see Eminos. You click on Eminos. 
join telegram link scroll down you see join telegram link you click on it same thing you choose arabic join telegram link you click on it the video of this recording will be out so you can watch that yes guys i guess we have come to the end of this everyone on this call should know how to take trades now and yeah basically that's all you are welcome good night everyone <laughs> I said with the share screen on screen. I will end the call. Don't worry. Okay, bye guys. Thank you all. As long as you feel confident to one week tops, you should go live in your second week. Or maybe the third day on your second week. Please ask your question, Shapali. Any questions you the the recording will be drop on the WhatsApp group. So how whatever WhatsApp group that you are on, I know we have people from uh, on here. So if you're on Konokopia, will be dropped. If you're on Infinity Peeps, will be dropped there. You don't have a problem. Yes, your lot size does not change because of the signals. You just once you do your um FX calculator, like I showed you. You put your stop loss and then it tells you what loss size to use on that particular trade. You're good to go. Just follow it. It has calculated your risk management for you because some people don't use to forget to change their loss size. But if you remember to always do your FX calculator, it calculates the risk for you. All you have to do is put in the lot size is telling you on your standard lot. Do you understand? So you're good to go. Bye, everyone.